All right, what's going on, guys? It's Ev from Guy Boston Sports, and we have uh, we have something a little bit different today. We're going to be putting together a puzzle, a 3D puzzle, sent to us from Foco Forever Collectibles. Um, you can go to foco.com to pick this bad boy up. We're gonna do. Uh, I'm not I'm not a self-proclaimed puzzle whiz by any means, so we're gonna see if I can put this together. I haven't even opened it yet, so we're gonna uh, we're gonna record all that and see if I can even get this thing together. Hopefully, it doesn't take all day. Before we get started, I wanted to shout out the Air Benny shirt that we released last year. Still have the t-shirts in stock, the navy t-shirt with the uh, obviously red logo and red design here. So head over to guybossonsports.com slash store if you want to cop this bad boy. Alright, so my head's going to be up there, but I will keep talking to you guys. Um, here we go, here's the packaging. I took all my personal information, I already cut a little slit so this doesn't get messy. Um, but here's the packaging from Foco. Love the relationship we're building with these guys. They really do have awesome products, not just Red Sox, um, not even just Boston Sports, obviously. So head over there if you're a fan of any team, officially licensed gear, uh, collectibles, everything like that. So let's get into it. Here is the box, and I must say, this is clean. It is only 89 pieces. Um, which is obviously low for a puzzle, but this isn't your normal puzzle. This is a 3D puzzle, and we'll see how I do with that. But age of 7 to plus, so we're good. But let's get into it. Let's open this bad Larry up. Try and preserve the packaging as well as I can. So we have the manual, I guess we'd call it. Um, yeah, here we go. Here are the pieces. That's intimidating. That is like reading a big book. All right, we got our pieces laid out. We got our directions. Uh, after opening that, I'm intimidated, which is a good thing. Foco's challenging me here. So uh, first page of the directions. We're looking for number one. That should be easy enough, right? Like, I should be able to find a number one here. So it took me a little bit, but I figured out yeah, this is a 3D puzzle. Way to keep it smart up there. Um, so, let's see what we got moving on. Alright, we have our base. Finally. <laughs> I'm telling you, this is a challenge. It is. These little, uh... These little peg things here, I don't know if you can see that, but they, they're, they're the inserts. Took me a while to figure those bad boys out. So, uh, yeah, so far, so good. Let's get going here. What's next in the direction? So I've done A, B. Now it's time to turn on to C. Alright, so the base is complete now. These things, I'm getting better at this. I am getting better at this. It's a little tough though.
Alright guys, let's check it out. Let's get some of those little pieces out. What do we think? What do we think? Pretty awesome job. That's a wrap. Alright guys, one last shout out to Foco. This was awesome. This was a lot of fun. It probably took me... I'm going to time lapse that and do it a little faster so it's going to be quick for you guys. But it probably took me close to an hour. But uh, it was an hour well spent, and I don't, I'm not just saying that because they sent this to me. That was really fun, and look at the end result. This is sweet. This is awesome. You can put this in the middle of your kitchen table, and it'll look great. So head over to foco.com if you do want to pick up this Fenway puzzle for yourself. Again, it took me like an hour, so if you have an hour to spare, if you want to have some fun, it generally was an hour well spent. So head over there and pick it up, and just tell them we sent you. This is, a, uh, this is awesome.